Here we are with another contestant of Adasari competition. Uh, could you introduce yourself to our viewers? Yes, hello. My name is Avram Benjamin Molonfalian. I'm from Romania originally, and I'm happy to be here. And we can hear from how you oh, yeah. speak that you are bass. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so is it, a, is it a very common voice? Because I think during the competition, we don't have uh, a lot of bass voices. Yeah, I would say from the male voice categories, mm -hmm. bass is probably one of the most rare. Mm -hmm. Of course, there's always subcategories in the bass voice as well. I consider my voice more of maybe a bass baritone. Maybe uh -huh. other, um, other people might consider themselves more of a low prof profundo bass. Uh -huh. So, yeah, it's... it's okay, you're thing. full of emotions, you're full of adrenaline, as you said. Yes, How yes, do you uh, feel after the performance? Good, good. Uh, it's nice to have this release to sing the first round and mm -hmm. we'll see now how it goes forward. Okay, tell me about what you sang in the first round. Yes, in the first round I sang uh, King René Zarioso from um, Yolanta by Tchaikovsky. Mm -hmm. It's a dramatic aria, but uh, basically King René is talking about Yolanta, she mm -hmm. cannot see, she's a... Okay, and uh, sh uh, this um, doctor came to said that there might be a chance that she will see. So in this, he's struggling with his emotion of actually, will she see, will she not see mm -hmm. in the mm -hmm. future? Mm -hmm. And of course, praying to God that she will mm -hmm. see and she will not spend her life in darkness. So uh, it's full, an area full of emotions. Yeah, yeah, and the second one? And the second one, it's a very popular aria, Madamina. It's Le Porello's aria from the opera Don Giovanni by Mozart. <coughs> it's, uh, yeah, it's uh, Le Porello's moment when he really enjoys to uh, this Elvira with his big catalog of uh, women that yeah, Don Giovanni yeah, yeah, conquered, yeah. of yeah, it's course. It's a very popular piece. Yes. Do you like singing popular pieces, the f pieces of opera, fragments of opera that everybody knows, or do you prefer to sing something that might surprise the audience because they know, don't know it so well? Good question. I, should, I think I like to sing rare pieces, but I think you know, in this profession you cannot avoid the main pieces, yeah. so you will have to take them head on. But I do enjoy some discovering new repertoire and bringing mm -hmm. it in a concert or, yeah, in a competition mm -hmm. probably in the future. So, uh, because everybody needs to sing Mozart, that's yes. why I ask almost everyone about Mozart. How do you feel with Mozart? Do you like Mozart, or do you feel just obligated to sing his uh, pieces? I love I love to to sing Mozart. Uh, I think it's it's one of the of course best composers, and he writes in mm -hmm. such a pure way for the voice that you cannot mm -hmm. really hide behind the music mm -hmm. and the text, of course. And the text and the music go so well together in Mozart that you can create really this dramatic moment. And it, it is, I think, for me, enjoyable to sing Mozart. Mm -hmm. But it does require good technique and to be able to sing it well. And uh, it's not always easy. Yes, I think this not hiding aspect is yes. why they choose Mozart for the first round that you need to sing Mozart because it shows yes. uh, all the uh, all you can do with your voice and but uh, also I think about the context all those uh, pieces are parts of a bigger bigger thing bigger of picture course. so do you think about it do you think about balancing a balance between technique and acting and being the person you are yes yes I mean once you're on stage um, you cannot really think about technique mm -hmm. That technique should become in subconscious, <laughs> of course, and then you just think about delivering what the composer intended, mm -hmm. that dramatic moment that's written in the music and in the text. So that's my focus, at least I try to achieve that. Mm -hmm. Of course, it's always a struggle if there's some technical aspects that you still want to solve and still need to improve. There's always this battle in between, but yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, But it's also, very, I, I think it might be difficult because you have a very short time on stage and you sing two very different things so you have to like switch between very different emotions and is, is that difficult I, I would say so I would say so because if you would <coughs> sing both of these pieces in their context in mm -hmm. their operas of course you have an entire scene before yes, probably that yeah. prepares mm -hmm. you for it and you're already the character mm -hmm. on stage so you don't have to become the character in like split of a second so yeah there's a challenge in that mm -hmm. I would say but it's also of course showing a lot mm -hmm. if you're able to do it, if you're able to make these differences between different pieces. Mm -hmm. Did you feel any support from the jury during singing? Some, you know, unspeakable support, but you, the support you can feel, or did, were you not thinking about it at all? 
I would say I felt. I mean, of course, I tr uh, it's not good to be too aware mm -hmm. of the audience. I mean, it's okay to interact and give to the jury, the audience. But of course, it's if you're too aware of them, mm -hmm. then it can also be dangerous because <laughs> you forget what you're doing on stage. Mm -hmm. So, of course, there has to be a balance of giving and taking yes. when you perform. And the last question about the Adosari competition itself. How did you get to know about the competition? I think, actually... Probably the internet. I was researching mm -hmm. for um, singing competitions, and I was looking when is the deadline. I think, and I came also across Adasari, mm -hmm. and uh, yeah, I took a chance in applying, and okay. yeah, it felt like a good competition. To, I mean, actually, it's my first uh, international competition oh. that I go to, so I felt like it's a good competition to try this, mm -hmm. and so far, okay. I'm enjoying it. <laughs> Thank you. Wish you all the best. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Thank you.